my name is brother Duhirwe Jean Pomsen. I'm uh, a Marist brother of uh, 31 years old. And uh, I got professed in uh, 2018. And uh, right now, I'm uh, in the Erdeka community. I would like to share my experiences uh, in this life of Marist brothers. Uh, I came to know my brothers the time I was uh, in a second high school in Titi Simul. There I was uh, in 2008 out to 2010. Uh, there I uh, met brothers, different brothers who were sharing to us the life of my brothers. By then, I came to know their life and I could observe how they do apostolate. And uh, I felt that it could be uh, one of uh, my best life to live. And uh, later on, I went in the uh, in upper level, second school, there was in the TC survey, and uh, their life was quite good. And uh, I kept uh, in touch with brothers. And there, life was quite uh, good, and uh, I enjoyed there how brothers were treating students. And uh, after there, I I started aspiring gradually, and uh, I joined uh, the first stage, which is uh, called a uh, postulants. I joined 2015. It was in Tanzania. In the Tanzania, it was uh, the best starting moment of uh, learning who brothers are and uh, learning how they do a postulate, learning how to live with other brothers, learning all about Marist. And uh, after postulants, I felt happy and uh, because whatever we were learning there was in accordance of what I wanted. And the, my journey went on, and I also went to, to novitiate. And when I reached novitiate, I was helped deeply, especially in how to pray. I also learned different skills, and also to socialize with others. And there, uh, my life continued, and uh, it was uh, quite a good experience. Uh, finishing Lovishet and uh, getting the chance of receiving the profession of the first vow in 2018. And there, uh, my life was a bit motivated when I got to profess. And uh, later on, in uh, 2018, Oh, the same month of August, I went to Mick, and in the Mick there, it was a very, it was a, they call it <coughs> scholastic, where <coughs> we run skills, we run, in, we have different courses. Actually, we have two programs there. We have DRS, which is Diploma in Religious Studies, as well as we have. Uh, um, our our program like me i was doing uh, mathematics and business in the education department and the the life in me actually was characterized by uh, many learning experiences doing research in terms of academics it was a time of to explore to to learn from others from different countries <coughs> and uh, to socialize. And also I was uh, quite uh, contributing some of you aspects in the formation where I was gifted to, I could try my best to help others. And uh, in general, life in the formation 
maybe stopping by me was quite uh, good and uh, I appreciate my fellow brothers uh, we will join it together above all I thank God for the gift of brothers whatever we perform together and it was really uh, very very important to join with them and the uh, what I may invite people, especially to the young men and women who want to join the religious life today, is uh, to to cultivate the, the spirit of trusting in God. God is so loving. People should learn to trust Him. Trust that through God everything is possible. Our life today is quite challenging. To the point that people forget God, they think that without God they can do things on their own. But I tell you the truth that trusting, putting God at the forefront is what is the the most important. You see, for instance, uh, when a child is born. He or she learns to trust the parents. And her life or his life become very successful because of trust. Not only to trust, but also uh, what goes in the hands of trusting is to love. We should learn to love God. Uh, as he loves us unconditionally, we love God, we love our neighbors. And the uh, also, I would like to share about uh, my life today. Today, uh, I'm in a new community of Edbeka. There, we are experiencing a lot. It's a new community. Uh, we started the journey in the 29th of October this year. And we are at the beginning of the community. We are running. We are, uh, putting things in order so that we start a life in a very good start. And uh, we are praying a crucial part to also to those who will come next uh, such a way that today my life will be good. And uh, those who are starting life today, of course, we are facing a tough life there. But to those who will come later on, they will enjoy life there. Eldeka, it is uh, actually it means it said what you get. The word it said means high school. If you translate literally, it said what you is uh, high school of Kigali. And uh, I may end this uh, sharing by wishing you all the best. And uh, we pray that uh, to those who want to be Marist brothers, may have a successful time and moment to think about this life. It is not uh, tough as many people may expect. Life is good. We should embrace it and we accept where the life moves us to go. Thank you and uh, we shall meet next time. <laughs>